So the time has finally come where I eat another Morrison colour. Whoopee do. Well, as many of you know, I actually ate the Morrison Volcanic Vindaloo. It was okay. I'm not going to deny it. it wasn't not spicy. I'm not immune to the heat of curry, so I'm sure it affected my eyes and whatnot, and streamed out my nose, whatever you say. This time round, though, I'm going to be trying Morrison's new spicy curry. I was surprised when they approached me and said they'd like to use a bit of my footage from a previous video in a Morrison's campaign and it was featured on places like Sun and Lad Bible. So that's quite a, that's quite good. So they've now challenged me to attempt to eat their new Morrison's spiciest curry ever, which is higher rated chili value than the other curry. The volcanic vindaloo. So We've got it all prepared here. First of all, we do have our traditional or uh, our Dr Pepper, which is here. Dr Pepper. And I may need that. So, let's start. We have the curry here. As you can see it's a different setup this time round. I'm not at my dining table, but quite a shiny angle. I almost spilled it all over myself then. So we have the Morrison Indian Flaming Fiery Fan. Read that on the front. It's an exceptionally red hot and fiery chicken curry made with scorpion and naga chilies. The volcanic vindaloo, if I remember, which had a bit of naga paste and a few chilies. This one, I'm going to get told I will eat my words. What words? I don't know. Probably. Wow, that spicy. Not. So I'm just going to dive in. Spent about 10 minutes eating a curry last time. Wasn't particularly exciting. This time round though, what we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, Come on. Eight pieces of chicken. So I'm just going to eat the eight pieces of chicken. There's a big red chili here as well. And we'll see how we go. Hopefully. I won't have to eat the can of Dr Pepper. Won't do anything anyway, but it makes it spicy. I don't know if it's even chicken, this one it doesn't feel as firm. I don't want to spill it all over. So here, the first mouthful of Morrison's Fiery Bar. Not as hot as before. So, first mouthful, it's still pretty what people really do. It actually tastes just as spicy as the previous one. I was expecting my first mouthful, regretting and not actually wanting to eat the second mouthful. So there we go, well, I'm almost finished now. A hell of a lot of sauce in this one. Shame. No naan breads this time, I just couldn't be bothered to cook them because I don't think I ate them last time anyway. I suppose I can certainly feel it in the back of my throat already. But it's again, I feel like I've had spicy takeaway curries. So not, I feel like I'm not trying. I'm going, end up, I'm, I'm going to try and drink this curry sauce afterwards. That might, actually might kill me on both ends. So we've only got one chicken, I don't know, I can't see the chicken anymore. It's a little hot. I feel my eyes starting to well up a bit. <coughs> and it definitely is getting the back of my throat. So again, surely I've had, we've all had similar experiences just eating any old curry from your local Indian takeaway. Or ethnic minority takeaway maybe. Mm. This eye is watering. I'm just crying that. Ugh, I don't know. 
Oh, that's all gone now. That, it really is that, that little, that small amount. One piece of chicken left. I'm wondering if it'll kick in the heat. In the minute when I scoff this chilli. That's it, I've eaten all the chicken. That was pretty disappointing. I can't pick it up because it's a fluffy, fluffy cut chilli. Getting prepared. There you go. I got a feeling that's a, a naga chiller. They try and eat it. Somehow it's messy as buggery. Not that I know, because I don't indulge in buggery, but I've heard from people. Oh, it's quite messy. Are you there? Ah, ah, ah. Nah. More than one to open the kind of dot pepper just to wash it down as a good meal. Catching on in me, I'm just having a snack. So that's it, we've just got sauce left, but am I supposed to drink this bugger now? I don't have to drink it all because it's bland and boring. Eating that chilli. Got a cup of chilli sauce now. Look at all that bullshit, what's all that crap? Probably should have made some rice. Ah. That's it. What more can I say? My eyes are slight. I, I, I actually believe actually now that the volcanic vindaloo was hotter. I was. I had my doubts about using this one. I really did. I, I was kind of felt like putting it up a little bit, thinking that they really had gone out, taken all the stops out, and released a very, very hot, spicy supermarket colour. Sadly, Morrison's, you have failed. Even though I can feel my eyes water in a little bit, mouth excited and tingling like it should be, but that's it. Sorry, Morrisons. Hopefully, you'll do better next time. Bye. A few moments later. <laughs> Come <laughs> on,